Hello and welcome to this quick overview about what's new in the latest version of Odin. So first off, we have the new Getting Started window, which greets you the first time you import Odin. Here we'll see all of the different demos. So in the previous versions, the demos were included by default, but from now on, you have to individually import the examples that you'd like to try. Let's start with the attributes. I've already imported them, so just click the button if you haven't already. And once it's imported, you can click the green button to open the scene. So here we see all of our attributes uh, in example. And they have been recategorized uh, to make it easier to find what you're looking for. So just to show some things that have changed in the latest version, we now have enum pagination. So you can click on the sides to toggle through the list in the enum. And here we have a longer list, and as you can see, we can go through it. And in this case, it actually changes the tool we use for Unity. Also, we have preview fields. So in this version, we can create preview fields by adding a very simple tag. So if I open this script, you can see that we can now add the preview field attribute, which in turn will allow us to display a little preview box. We can also drag it around, which is very convenient. All right, let's go to the next demo, which is Editor Windows. So I'm just going to click Open the Getting Started window, and here we get all the demos for the windows. So let's open the first one, Open Window. So this is a window drawn by Odin. As you can see, we have a little field here. And you can click on the Open Script button to just see what code is used to display this window. So let's go to a more complicated window as an example. So here we have a complicated window with on the side a hierarchy that is all defined through code. We can change the height of the elements, we can change the offset, we can change the color, etc. All of this is drawn through a little bit of code that we can just open if we click the button here. With the new editor window support, you can now add all the power of Odin and use it inside your editor windows. Another great new feature in the latest version of Odin is that we have the little pencil here. You can click on it with the lift mouse button and it will open the inspector in a new window. This is very useful, but you can also right click on it and it will open directly within your existing window. Another nice feature that has been improved is that you can now use non-string members in the box groups and layout groups. So in the previous versions, you had to reference a string field. However, in the new version, you can reference non-string values, which will then use the toString method. And there we go. And that's it for this quick update. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you have any comments or feedback, please leave them below in the comment section because we'd love to hear from you. See you in the next one.